Check out this video of a rare fish, quite literally out of the water in the Florida Keys. And this alarming wildfire, uh, wildlife officials is just one part in a string of mysterious behavior and deaths involving sawfish. It's an endangered species known for its long spiked snout. Xavier Walton is in Florida this morning. Good morning, Xavier. You had the chance to speak with scientists investigating this mystery. They seem a bit confused. Tell us more. Hannah, good morning. You know what? They are extremely confused and at the same time, extremely concerned because they don't know what's causing this major problem. It's crazy, man. For months, scientists have been trying to solve a mystery in the Florida Keys. He's big. Dr. Dean Grubbs, a deep water researcher, has been studying small toothed sawfish for more than 15 years. And so it's disheartening for us to, to see it, obviously. You see these videos and you see, you know, these pictures of either the sawfish in distress or just flat out dead. As somebody who is passionate about them, how does that make you feel, man? It's heart wrenching in some ways because it's distressing for us if we see just one animal that is is killed, you know, uh, by a person or something. According to Florida's Wildlife Commission, there have been more than 50 sightings of sick or dead sawfish in the Lower Keys since November. The FWC is currently testing the animals and collecting samples to find the cause. It was almost like seeing a unicorn or a Sasquatch in real life. That initial excitement is short lived. Sad to see that, you know, they're dying too. It's not that you can just see him swimming around like dolphins and he swim away and you're like, wow, that was really cool. It's like, man, this poor thing's dying. You know, you can tell something wasn't right. Sawfish are critically endangered species and rarely seen, if at all, in the Florida Keys. That's why the last three months have been so puzzling for researchers trying to solve the deadly problem. I am waiting as much as everybody else to figure out what it is. None of that is normal. They should not be swimming in a circle. They should not be so shallow that the rostrum is out of the water. All of that is abnormal behavior. And Henna, you know what? It's not just uh, sawfish. It's um, groupers, tarpon, other fish um, displaying bizarre behavior. So, you know what? Just extremely alarming there along the Florida Keys. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.